Opportunity Village, an organization that serves people with special needs, says there is an increasing number of people they serve and they need to expand their property. Good evening, I'm Marie Mortera. They're proposing a new housing community in the Centennial Hills area. Our Kalia Patterson is here in studio to tell us why some residents are concerned about the development. Well, Marie, those residents and Opportunity Village representatives met tonight to discuss those concerns. The proposed development will be a gated housing community with 90 units for people with special needs and their families. Developers say the space will feature a park, cafe and thrift store open to the public. Opportunity um, Opportunity says currently there are almost 300 families waiting on the list there to live there. One family in the organization says it's important that special needs children become independent and have assistance like this when their parents get older. Justin's been going to Opportunity Village for about 12 years now, so it's it's been an amazing program for him. Um, it gives him a, a purpose every day to be able to ride the bus and go somewhere and um, he has friends and staff loves him and he goes out. Of, and as we get older, obviously, there's a lot of things we can't do like lifting him and some of those harder things and managing him. So this is going to give us an opportunity to place him in a facility, hopefully. All right, that's going to take care of those needs. And we're really psyched. The presentation was wonderful. Uh, it ticked all the boxes for us, uh, and, and it's going to meet the needs of their community and our community simultaneously. I think synergistically we'll work really well together. Despite the need, the main concern was traffic and its impact to residents. Dozens of neighbors saying the entry proposed for the complex would be a problem because of commercial traffic already. Opportunity Village then suggested one way in and one way out on Rome and Tom Boulevard, but residents were still dissatisfied. The developers would even add detached sidewalks for pedestrian safety. Standing here right now today, I'm, I'm not sure. And more traffic will be, bring more crime. Everybody knows that lives in the area of Rome is very um, high density traffic right now. So I think that's a big concern. Opportunity Village themselves, the people are great. Um, we're hoping that something can be figured out with the traffic flow. And many of our folks are not gonna drive their own cars. So the traffic that we're gonna bring into the community is gonna be RTC buses with specialized transportation, right? I think that there are things we can do to mitigate the traffic utilization of those streets and we'll continue to look at that in our drawings. But I feel like this community, when they see it, is gonna bring so much to the neighborhood. The conversation moves forward with answers from the city on May 14th at 6 p.m. at City Hall with a conversation with those residents. Opportunity Villa says they plan to break ground on this community in the fall. Live in studio, Kalia Patterson, News 3. Lots of voices heard tonight. Thank you for bringing that insight, Kalia.